colors are one of the vital information like the filter are a very important aspect of graphic design so i believe um most of us are always finding it difficult to select colors for our design all right so in this video i i found it fit to you know um, explain in my little way of understanding how i select colors and this is going to help some and uh, most designers out there you know um because i get dms on people's um finding it difficult on how to select colors for their um, for their projects so in this video i want to explain this all right so um if you're new to this channel please don't forget subscribe to this channel share this video and if you have any question please drop a comment in the comment section below so um into this video here as you can see this is my um, color draw interface so basically what we're going to be learning in this video is how to select the right colors for our project okay so i got this um this um model all right from google so i'm going to drop the link of this image in the down description below so you can actually check it out all right so um this is assuming you want to design um this flyer okay or a flyer and you're to use this image so what should come to your mind is what are the colors that is going to suit the design i want to make all right these are the the question you we sometimes ask ourselves all right so if you want to select colors that will suit your design fast and without any further delay all right or waste so much time in your design okay let's um, first of all put this um, image into this frame now right click and place into this frame all right and right click again and select this power clip to fit it to frame all right anyhow you want it to be okay so let's assume you've placed your image and this is the right way you want it to be now the next thing should, that, that you want to look into is the colors all right the colors for the design now let's pick colors that is going to match the design we want to um, want to um, do all right so now what we're going to do is i'm going to bring in this um ellipse tool and place uh, all this shape here all right so now you can see we have um our objects so if you want to design anything first of all look at the image you're using all right you can actually get colors from the image you want to use for example this image now we have she's wearing um the model is wearing a pink um, um hair tie all right and she's she has um this orange and um, dark orange um and clothes she's wearing on you can actually get colors from this you can see this um this um let's say this red uh, um, color the bang which is putting on so all you need to do is just come over to your pick two all right come over to your pick two um select this pink place it here all right then select your pick tool again you can actually let's copy this color this brown color here all right you can actually pick this brown color you can pick it drop it here all right you can select again come over to this and pick a color here drop all right pick another color all right from the subject just pick a color and drop okay guys so basically you can see we have pink we have um orange we have brown this dark brown and we have the um can i call this red or um maroon okay now you can actually see these colors all right so what we're going to do now is basically you can actually go to um google and get colors how i do it is i go and look at colors that relate to pink so we can go to google and see all right now you can see pink color palette so once you um you just um type in pink color palette you can see different colors that goes with um pink now if you type orange color palette so we are picking this color from the subject we have now you can see orange color palettes you can see orange color all right you can see this co co colors that goes with orange you can see this so let me say i'm selecting this one let me copy this and paste it here 
all right let me copy and paste here i can go again and go to that and select pink color palette all right so let me go down let me go down down and let's keep searching and basically you can see this all right you can see this you can also see this these are pink these are light pink you can see this let me copy this let me drop this here all right so i'm going to go again and choose other ones you can see this one let me copy and paste here now guys um basically let me say one to fill in this background with any color if you select your pick two and let's choose black black is just maybe a neutral color you can see it's matching and it's bringing out the color of the model very very well all right this is bringing out the color of the model even without any do, doing anything uh, with this you're just good to go add your text and you know you're just good to go and some gradients and some basic effects you're good to go now if you select your pick um eyedropper two if you pick this color drop here you can see it's going so smoothly and unique all right let me assume i add the text here and say okay um nike all right let me just put this nike here you can see if you change the fonts let's say um blue scripts let me change the fonts let me say pink blue this font you can see guys this is just unique all right so if i pick another color here let me say i'm using my eyedropper tool and i pick this orange color and drop it here you can see how unique and it's going so unique like is blending with the um the model color which you have here so if i select this eyedropper tool again and pick up this color drop it here you can see is blending very well with the colors which you have so basically guys selecting color in um for your for your graphic work is um is in, is in your mindset and it's basically thinking about okay what are the um colors i can see in my screen what is the the color of the model which is, what is the color of the image but sometimes you'll be working and you will see that okay you're not working with um you're not working with an image all right i understand that part you can basically get colors from you know anything around you you understand just imagine it from your mind so in this case these are just the simple way to get colors for your design so basically let's assume um i'm picking this one this color you can see how unique is blending with our image so as you can see basically guys so let's assume i'm taking this blue color blue will go just perfect with this image you know blue and orange blue and pink like just that imagination you understand so let's assume i want to add a, gra a gradient to this so let me assume i'm using my interactive field tool i draw this way and add a color so let me assume i'm adding this color to it you can see i'm adding blue and orange so let's assume i'm adding blue and um orange and this and this pink you can see how unique it is you can see how unique it is i'm adding orange and pink all right so this goes this goes very 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 well so let me say i'm adding this um um blue this light blue and pink you can see how unique is going so these are basic ways you can select colors for your graphic work all right so if you have other question if you're confused in any way you can basically drop me a comment in the comment section below so in another option we have here you can see the colors which we picked earlier so let me assume i'm taking this color you can see how it's going very unique all right so let me assume i'm taking this color i want to make use of this color for the design you can see how it's going with the image you have you understand so let's assume we're taking another color from here this light blue it's very unique all right so these are the basic ways you can actually um get color i believe you enjoy this um tutorial if you have any question if you're confused in any way you can basically drop me a comment in the comment section below 
like this video if you enjoy it and share this video with your friend see you guys in my next video